If you're like me, you probably drink water once in a while. I recently picked up a new water bottle from Zulu, a 24-ounce model called the Ace. This water bottle has been great for the month or so that I've had it, but recently the flip-top lid flip-flopped itself apart. Ten seconds of googling revealed that this is a pretty severe design flaw. The lid simply chews through the o-ring in a shockingly short period of time. I never dishwashed my lid, but I imagine this would cause the o-ring to become brittle and fail even sooner. Zulu does sell replacement lids on their website, but these were out of stock at the time of this recording, and comments on the page indicate that these are frequently unavailable. After taking some quick measurements of the broken o-ring with a pair of calipers, I ordered a lifetime supply of replacements on Amazon, link in the description. I'll now run through the process of replacing this o-ring so you can get back to what you love, drinking water. Take the lid off the bottle and open it up. Locate the metal hinge pin. This is simply press fit into the plastic, so you'll need to push something of similar diameter into the hole in order to push it out. I used a small screwdriver bit I had lying around. Be careful when hammering on the bit. Metal and plastic are not the best of friends, and you could pretty easily crack parts of the lid here. Take it slow and try to keep a firm grip on the lid while hammering. Once the pin is pushed far enough through the hole, pull it out to set it aside. Remove the top lid and pull out the remains of the old o-ring. The tricky part here is hooking the new o-ring around the top lid and positioning it correctly on the bottom half of the lid. Again, take it slow and make sure you get the o-ring around both sides of the bottom hinge before attempting reassembly. Once the o-ring is settled into place, reinsert the metal hinge pin. This will take some jiggling of both lid halves in order to seat the pin correctly. Push the pin in as far as it'll go by hand. The final step is to gently hammer the hinge pin back in place. I used a larger diameter screwdriver bit here to ensure that I stayed on the hinge pin while hammering. When the hinge pin is flush with the plastic, you're all done. I'd recommend snagging a replacement lid if you come across one. It's only a matter of time until the plastic around the hinge cracks or the latch mechanism breaks, which is another common failure point with these. Apparently Zulu will send you a new water bottle if your lid breaks, but that's a very wasteful solution to an easily solvable problem. Hopefully they release a new revision of the lid that addresses these issues. Anyway, I hope you found this helpful. Happy drinking, or whatever else it is you do with water bottles.